Hello, what's up my freeze drying friends? In today's video, I am taking on a viewer request of something to go in my freeze dryer and I think it's going to be amazing. I had a comment in one of my videos when I had asked for suggestions of things to freeze dry. Someone suggested doing pineapple. So we got a couple pineapples and we are going to freeze dry pineapple today. It is currently snowing outside. So I am just going to take this pineapple and pretend like I am on the beach in Hawaii enjoying some delicious tropical fruit. <laughs> I think this is gonna be so good freeze dried. I can't wait to try it. I'm hoping my kids will like it. I'm excited. I am always looking for ideas of things to freeze dry. I've already got a list going of things you guys have sent me. So thank you so much. If you got any ideas or requests, leave them in the comments below and I will put them on my freeze drying list. If you remember on my channel, I am never going to repeat a food or a recipe in my videos. I always wanna be showing you something new to freeze dry. It can be crazy, it can be fun, it can be candy, it can be fruit, meat, healthy foods, whatever. If you got an idea, let me know. I'm happy to try it out. I am also getting closer to that 500 subscriber mark. Thank you to all of my new friends who have joined along on my channel. It has been so much fun getting closer to 500. Hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribing. Once I hit 500, I am going to do an epic, crazy freeze drying run in my freeze dryer. I haven't quite decided what it's gonna be yet, but I've got some ideas, but it's gonna be fun. So hit that subscribe, leave me a comment of any suggestions of things you wanna see freeze dried. We're gonna go get this pineapple cut up and ready for the freeze dryer. In my settings, I am going to hit reset. I wanna hit fast dry mode. I'm gonna increase this by a few hours. I like to have this extra dry time on a high number of hours because sometimes things are like finished in the middle of the night and I'm not ready to obviously take them out of the freeze dryer. If you have the extra dry time set, it'll just keep drying and that's not gonna hurt your food. And then it'll be ready to come out like in the morning when you wake up. So I'm doing that. I'm gonna hit save and I'm gonna hit start and we're waiting our 15 minutes. I've got my pineapples in my kitchen here. I'm going to cut these up. I really am not good at telling if fruit is ripe or not in Alaska. It's very slim pickings on our fresh produce that we get. So I just grabbed what I thought looked decent. I'm gonna get these cut up. No, I am not a professional pineapple cutter. I'm just gonna do my best and get them on my trays. I don't know that these two pineapples are gonna fill all of my trays, so I might need to add something else that I have in my fridge to go in this freeze drying run. I've got my pineapple all chopped up. Let's give a little taste test. Yum, super good, super sweet, super juicy. <laughs> We are going to get these on our trays and then they are ready for the freeze dryer. All right, as you can see, my pineapple filled up two trays. Should have bought more pineapples. It's about one pineapple per tray, it looks like. I'm going to figure out something to add to those trays now. Here's the final product. I've got two pineapple trays. I went through my produce and found I had overripe bananas that needed to be used and I found some apples. I am not counting the bananas and apples as a repeat recipe because this is still my pineapple video. I just don't want to waste real estate in my freeze dryer. We got to use up all the trace space we can. So this is what's going in today. I will take this down to the freeze dryer and get it loaded up. I am closing my drain valve. I'm going to get these loaded up. Sideways. <laughs> Three. And 
my number four. Okay, everything's in. We are gonna hit continue. And we are freezing. I am super excited to try these out. I have no idea what they're gonna taste like. I've had like the dehydrated pineapples before that you can get, but I've never had freeze dried. So I will have to see what the difference is and I will let you know. We will do our taste test when these are all done. I don't know how long these are gonna take. They're very high moisture content, so I have a feeling it'll be a while. We'll keep you guys posted on the progress and let you know when they're ready to come out. Just to give you guys an update, we are at the 25 hour mark of these being in the freeze dryer. We're in the extra dry time. Uh, remember I had it set for seven or eight hours, so we're about two hours into the extra cycle. They're looking nice and dry. I am not quite ready to take these out yet. I might do a test and see if they seem like all the moisture has been removed. Um, but just wanted to give you that update and we will go from there. Okay, hello, hello. I have a little bit of time right now to get my pineapple out of the freeze dryer. We're heading out the door soon to go skiing. So I'm gonna try to get this done quickly. I, the total time I have on here is 28 hours. Again, it went a little longer during the extra dry cycle. So we'll see how it is. I haven't tested to see if these are fully done or not. I'm gonna open my drain valve. Select defrost. We're gonna hear the machine turn off. Remove product from the door. Okay, here are our pineapple. All right, they feel like they are definitely done and like the moisture has all been removed. Even though it's our pineapple video, I'll still obviously show you the bananas and the apples. And I mean, can you get more tropical? <laughs> Very exciting. They're a little sticky. I should have used my mats, but they of course weren't clean. So I just did it on the trays, but they're popping off just fine. Bananas, the same apples same nice and crunchy all right i am going to bag these up to package these i am going to do both things again a jar and a mylar bag i know we're going to be snacking on these i may not even need this i don't know we'll see I will show you that these are super, if you can hear the crunch, <laughs> super completely light. All the moisture has been removed. They smell and look amazing. Still smells like a pineapple. One tray, this first tray here, filled one Mylar bag of the pineapple. So I'm throwing in my oxygen absorber. These are the bags and absorbers that came with my machine when I bought it. I haven't gone through all of them yet. So we're still just using those. I am gonna heat seal this together. This will be nice and preserved for my food storage shelves. I am going to vacuum seal this jar and just keep it in my pantry. These will be ones that we'll use throughout the next couple weeks to snack on. And I'll just be re-vacuum sealing each time I pull them out to use. Since we're gonna, I'm not trying to long-term preserve these. We're just gonna eat them because they're gonna be delicious. And then I've got a few left over for our taste test that we're gonna do in just a few minutes. I'm over here at my heat sealer that this also came with the freeze dryer. You will see your heat seal line across. I like to seal it two times just to be sure we got a nice solid 
seal. And there we go, all sealed up. This is ready for my first storage. Ah, sorry. Okay, and next I will take you upstairs and show you just how I vacuum seal my jar. I will also add that if you're interested in the full banana or apple freeze drying process, I have two, I have a video for each of those on my page under playlists. If you go under fruits, you will find the bananas and the apples video. I will also tag the videos here. You can just click on the little link up here and that'll take you right to the banana or apple video. For vacuum sealing, I am just going to use my food saver jar attachment. Get this little guy off of here. This goes here. I'm gonna turn my food saver on. Accessory. I'm just gonna pull all the air out of the jar. I like to run it twice just for good measure, so here we go again. I then just pop this off, pop this off, make sure this is nice and tight, which it is. Stick my ring on and these will keep nice and fresh in this jar. Coming up next, we will do our taste test of the freeze dried pineapple. I will also try just reconstituting the pineapple just in water and seeing how that tastes when we try to bring it back to life. What time is it kids? Taste test time. What are we taste testing today? All right, grab a pineapple. Have two. Sure. So, okay. <laughs> Whatever. So good. I mean two. Okay. Three. All right, back up, back up. One, two, three, go. Mm. I hear the crunch. It tastes mm. like a normal one. It tastes like mm. a pineapple? Mm -hmm. A normal one. Pretty yummy? Uh -huh. yeah. Good snack. Yeah. Buy again, Mommy. Okay. I'm glad you like it. Mommy's going to try it next. Okay, I am going to try it. Super good. Love it. It's light and airy and kind of gets like that pineapple juice once you start chewing it. Super good. I am now Gonna try to add a couple of these to water and see if we can rehydrate them and see what that looks like. So give me one second. All right, the boys are gonna help. They're each gonna drop in two pineapples into There's our two. dish of cool I'm water. Two. Okay. I'm two. All right, stick them in. Does take a spoon and stir them around. Hey, I'm on two. I'll do five, you can take turns. You do five. One, two, three, three four, four, five. five. Well, can I put in one more? Sure. Oh, okay. Put... Just do not put that one in. Not the one from the <laughs> five second roll. <laughs> Ready? Okay, stir them around. One, two, three, four, five. That's All right, nice. now we're gonna wait just a minute. We're gonna try the reconstituted pineapples. So here they are. Yeah. And here's the spoon. We've only had them in the water out. about five minutes. They probably need longer than that, but we're impatient. So we are gonna try them out. Do you wanna use a spoon or just try it? How do you, um, ready? Yeah. Yeah, ready? Ready for me? How do you for me? Is it still crunchy on the inside? Ready for me? Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> crunchy. Yeah, I think they need to last longer, but. Let's see, mommy. Will, I, I was gonna try one. <laughs> they were catching their Ooh. teeth. Mine was totally soft and juicy, yeah. just like a normal pineapple. Yeah, and mine and mine was hard and new. Like Mom, is this one crunchy? Teeth. Let's see how this one is. <laughs> crunchy or soft? Can I show mine? Soft. Woo, 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 woo! I love pineapple. 
Can I sorry? Oh, and here's the okay, monkey bar. Last one. Ready? Here's the monkey bar. <laughs> Hard. Sounds soft to me. Oh, it's soft. That wraps up our pineapple video. Thank you for watching. Are you craving pineapple now? I'm sure you are. It was delicious. Oh wow, my kid. Okay, I will try that again. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and you won't miss out on a thing that is going in my freeze dryer. <laughs> we are always gonna be freeze drying something new around here. So lots of exciting things to come. Thank you for following along. This has been so much fun. I am so excited to have all this freeze dried pineapple now. We will see you on the next freeze drying adventure. Bye.